Hi, uh, everybody. In this exercise, we're going to continue on with our rivet MEP. And in this lesson, we're going to look at the coordination review message. So you might wonder what that is. It is basically when you have two rivet files linked together, it'll notify you if it's something changing that is being monitored from rivet file to rivet file. So we linked models together in previous lessons. So uh, this time we set up uh, equipment levels to monitor and grids and things like that to monitor. So the coordination review message will actually tell us if something changed. So if the architect might change the level or move some equipment around and it'll notify me that if there's a mismatch between my level and the level or whatever change in the architect's project. So that's what we're going to cover in this lesson. So I'm going to open this file that I'm using for this assignment. And I click open there. Now, We've already done, I've actually changed one of the levels in one of these sample projects from this infinite steel study guide I used. And see right here, you'll get this message now. It'll say, instance link needs coordination review. It's telling me that the model, that the link model is something different in it. So if I expand this message, it'll tell me here on the warning one, is the architect's model. So to see this, we're going to bring up the coordination view window to see this. So we'll go OK and continue opening the project. Now we're opening our East Elevation and Mechanical. And here, once we're in here, you scroll over to the right, and you'll notice right away the second floor and the roof level are mismatches. Okay. So my second floor is, is 12 feet and it moved architect's model. He's changed it to 13 feet. And same thing with the roof. They changed the roof levels a foot, basically. So I can see what happens. So where would it show up now in the coordination review? So you can see that, let's go to the Collaborate tab, and then we'll go down to Coordination Review drop down, and then we'll hit Select Link. So once we select the link, we'll just mouse over one of the actual levels, and then we'll get this Coordination Review dialog box will open up for us. Now once you're in here, the window appears and we can see here what the actual messages are. There's two levels here and each one moved by one foot. If you click the plus to the left of each one, it'll, it'll tell you what actually moved. So it says our roof moved. It's a mismatch with my level name roof. Same thing with the one below it. Is a mismatch is here and here. So you have two things to make adjusted. Uh, on the right, under action, where it says postpone, you have a drop down here. And it gives you various options here how to handle this. If you say reject, it will just you know, reject what they did and just keep our level where we want it. You know where it is initially, basically. It's saying uh, accept differences. We're going to accept the difference, but we're going to still keep the length. Move the, or I could say move to match the architect. So I'm going to say move here. Now let's look at the other drop down. Same options here. Reject, accept. Here I'm going to say reject. And you can add comments. At least this expands what we did manually. Now 
Now at the top, you can group the element. And then here in the lower left, you can generate a report. That would be more or less the coordinator or who's ever in charge of the project or something that you would send back to the architect between firms. And then we'll say, okay, so it moved our roof to match the roof level of the architect's file, and then we rejected the second floor. I can I keep mine and they keep theirs. Now to see this information again, you can go back to coordination review, select link, choose the link. Now, the only one you see is the one that we rejected. The other was thrown away. If you do nothing, or we can come in here again, and we can say, accept the difference, or move the level to the second floor, click apply. So that's basically how you do uh, coordination review messages and how you manipulate it. It's a tool that allows you to see what's been monitored and changed from other link files or architect files or files that are linked to other files. So hey folks, thank you for watching this video. We'll continue on uh, basic MEP. And uh, I'll see you next time. Like or comment on this exercise if you like. And thanks for watching. Have a good one. Bye.